guys welcome back to another video on my channel so today we're going to be de-wipering the mini um bought a kit off of ebay came with the the bung for the hole a little bag of silicon i assume i'm not going to be using that though and a bit of super glue I'm not going to be using that either um so right yeah let's get into this right so first thing you want to do lift the cap up 13 mil socket undo the bolt with a bit of luck this should pop off it's Most of the time they get stuck, the seeds on there, sometimes you've got to cut them off with a hack for, but luckily we didn't have to do that this time. So right, now we've got to go inside the boot. So yes people, now we're in the boot, we've got to undo six Phillips head screws in the boot trim and then pop it off. And then now we've got access to the wiper motor. You've got three 10mm bolts holding that in. Just gonna get them undone. Before I should have undone them bolts, got to undo the clips and the hose. So, pop the hose off from there, and your electrical clip there, pull that out, and carry on. Then you've got to get out this rubber bung. Just pull it, it should come out. All right, so we've got your rubber bung out. So now we need to clean the hole. Sorry about these camera angles. I've got a head mount coming, so the video should get a lot better regarding camera angles. Clean that side, open the boot. I'm gonna clean this side, I'm gonna be careful because I've just got the windows tinted not long ago and I don't really want to disturb them. Right, so now we're down at the toolbox. We gotta put some sealant on this. It did come with this black bag of sealant and this tub of super glue, but we're not gonna use them because they're probably shit. So, got some tiger seal. Good stuff, this. We're gonna get some of that around the edge.
I'm gonna get plenty on there so it seals up. You don't want no water getting into your boot. Alright, that seems good enough to me. So right, now we're gonna mount this into the boot. Right, so you're going to get it in your roll where you want it. Push it, push it as far as it will go in. Right, so now you push the bung in and you get a bit of electrical tape. Right, you get a piece of electrical tape, tape it in so it doesn't move. Grab your coffee, window cleaner and cloth, shut the boot. Now you want to wipe off this excess. and I'm going to disconnect the washer bottle from this pipe. So, just put that to one side, we'll just tuck it away over there. That's the pipe. That's the pipe that goes all the way to the back, to the rear of the car. So, I'm going to plug this up with a screw and some PTFE tape. Right, so I'll bung that up with, some, with an old bolt. Couldn't find any PTFE tape, but that's not leaking. So, on the event that it does get switched by accident, it's not going to leak out. I'm just going to tuck that away down there because we don't need that to be in the engine bay anymore. Right, so yeah, now we're waiting for the season to dry on that. We are tucking this pipe. Good, yeah. Yeah, so now we've taped up the plug, put the pipe over there. And we've just got to wait for the sealant to dry on this. Which is miles off. that to dry and I'll come back to it later and see how we're going. Yes people it's been about 20 minutes half hour the silicon is now dry so we're gonna fit the boot trim back on and then yeah go up top and I'll show you the outcome. Make sure you bang around the whole edge so make sure your clips are back in.
some of these screws are going in at funny angles, so make sure you've got the angle right, or you might break your clip. Right, so now we've got all the screws back in. We're all fitted up, ready to go. Let's go back up to the outside. Right, now let's see how this has come out. Mastic still needs to drive a bit around the edges, but other than that, I'm pretty happy with that. So yes, guys, that's the end of the video. Thank you all so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. I think it looks a lot better without a wiper arm on there. Let me know what you think in the comments. Also, let me know what kind of content you want to see me do next. Um, are people enjoying it? Just let me know. Start a bit of a conversation up. Um, to all my new subscribers, thank you. Um, really hope you're enjoying the content. And uh, yeah, Swainy TV. Oh.